Have you ever been keeping up with the Bitcoin market and wondered what affects its price? Well, wonder no more. Let's dive right in. Uh, Bitcoin's price had been on a downward spiral for several days, hitting a low of less than $61,000 amid fears of what the U.S. Central Bank uh, would announce regarding with its monetary policy. Uh, but don't worry, there's a twist. Uh, the asset bounced back after the Federal Reserve outlined no significant changes and the rest of the market followed suit. Crazy, right? Uh, take a look at this graph from Crypto Potato, which shows the price declines that drove BTC to its lowest price tag in over two weeks. This all happened amid profit taking by certain investors, uh, significant spot Bitcoin adoptions, outflows, and fears about the FLMC meeting outcome. Uh, I endorse in my video. Uh, I really want to. Um, but let's get into the nitty gritty. The landscape improved a bit over the next 12 hours as Bitcoin recovered around $1,000. But the real improvement came after the U.S. Federal Reserve's second FOMC meeting for the year. Chairman Jerome Powell said the central bank wouldn't be raising interest rates further, at least for now. Uh, BTC reacted with an immediate 4% spike, followed by a more gradual increase to over $68,000. That's a gain of over $7,000 in less than a day. Although it has lost some ground since then, Bitcoin still trades above $67,000, meaning it has gained 9% on the day. Most altcoins have followed suit, with ETH skyrocketing 15 cents. There's a few minutes that have 17 million boxes cutting out in 2 million boxes. In this case, the whole reset, it's a dollar pull up for six. That's coming out uh, in 12 a third. But, uh, but of course, there's a catch. These volatile price movements have harmed over leveraged traders with nearly 100,000 getting wrecked in the past day. The total value of liquidated positions is at over $320 million dollars while the single largest one was on Binance worth $7 million. Yikes! And every single day with this marketing next month. And uh, that's why we talk about it. So there you have it, a, a wild ride for Bitcoin and other altcoins. With that said, thanks for watching. And uh, until next time.